NASA flight surgeon Dr. Charles Berry was worried. His patient, Colonel Jim Irwin, showed increasingly irregular heart rhythms, including begemony, a continuous alternation of long and short heartbeats. More troubling was his patient's location. Colonel Irwin was in lunar orbit in the middle of the Apollo 15 mission, almost a quarter million miles away from the nearest hospital. Dr. Berry told the Manned Spacecraft Center's deputy director, Chris Kraft, that he believed Irwin was suffering a heart attack, and if Irwin were back on Earth, he would take the astronaut immediately to an intensive care unit. But since Irwin was already breathing a 100% oxygen atmosphere, was continuously being monitored, and because the microgravity environment placed little strain on his heart, he was already in the equivalent of an ICU in space. Irwin was placed on light duty for the rest of the mission and returned safely to Earth. Unfortunately, he had coronary problems for the rest of his life, and due to his heart condition, Irwin became the first moonwalker to die in 1991 at the age of 61. Visit BAE.com for more surprising space facts.